Have you seen Kim? No, I haven't. That is strange. She told me she was going to be with you. Really? Yeah, and I've been looking for her all over the place. Uh, look, I don't know. You know what? I forgot my cell phone. Yeah, okay, no problem. Let's go see you, yeah, though. Yeah, good seeing you. Take all care, right. okay? All right. See you later. Oh boy. 
Hey Liz, what's going on with you? Why you didn't answer your phone when I called you earlier? I'm worried about you, hon. What's wrong? What situation? Is it dealing with the kids? Yeah, you do need a dream. We are having girls night out tonight. So be at my apartment at 7 p.m., okay? Miss Blackwell. Can you find the John White file for me, please? I've been looking all over for it. Hey, babe, how are you? I miss you so much. I cannot wait to see you tomorrow. <laughs> Boy, I'm going to hug it. Kiss all over you. I'm so happy right now to hear your voice. Well, I feel okay. I just wanted to go by. I'm ready to go home and wait for you tomorrow. Good morning, Miss Smith. Good morning, Denise. Have you seen the Johnson file in the office anywhere? I've looked everywhere and I can't seem to locate it. No, ma'am. If you find the file, can you bring it to my office for me, please? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. tell you about girls night out tonight because I sure do need it <laughs> because I'm having one hell of a day and I'm super hungry I need food girl <laughs> right all right cool I'll see you then bye I'm so happy this morning. And why are you so happy this morning? Oh, Eric must have texted you again. <laughs> he texts you like 50 times a day. I'm sorry that your relationship's not working. Stop hating no mind. Got work to do. Hey, Kia. 
Keisha, what is going on with you, girl? I'm about just to go to, to like, I'm hungry. So it's all over the place, girl. I can eat about 10 hamburgers right now. <laughs> My boss didn't say anything to me at all, oh, girl. I was surprised, but I was happy. <laughs> My stomach is growling. Get this snacks, Frida. I sure do. I heard your stomach could growl on like two hours ago, so you can have this. This is all I got. Well, thank you, Frida. You're welcome. Since I did save your stomach. I found the file for you. I found it under the file cabinet. Is there anything else I can do for you? Yes, Denise. Have a wonderful weekend. And I'll see you bright and early Monday morning. On time, correct? Right? Yes, ma'am. Have a great weekend, Miss Smith. Thank you. I told you she'd left that thug alone. You never listened to me. Now you're about to lose Chris, a good husband. A good man. And he doesn't look that bad either. I don't know what you see in Kane. I mean, what can he offer you? He has no damn money. He just got out of prison and he lives in a shack. And you're willing to give up all this for him? You are out of your damn mind. I know, Dina. I know. I'm so confused right now. I love Chris and I love Kane. I want them both. You just don't understand. What do you mean, Kimberly? Kimberly, are you telling me that you love Kane more than you love Chris? And are you telling me that you're willing to give up all of this for him? You're willing to give up your home, cars, money, shoes, and clothes for a man that can't even buy you a piece of gum? Are you serious right now? I don't know. I don't know what I will do. I know that I love Kane, but I don't want to lose my husband over this. Kimberly, I'm your best friend, and I just want what's best for you. We have been friends for 13 years. And we will continue to be best friends, but honey, you will lose Chris if you do not stop what you're doing. He works with the FBI and he can find out anything that he wants to. I know he works for the FBI. But Chris will never investigate me. We've been together for too long. I have never cheated on him, so he would never expect me of cheating. I've never cheated on him. Never. I hope you're right, because Chris is a strong man and a smart man. I love you, girl, and I just want you to be careful. But I'm going to leave before Chris gets here. I love you, too. I'll be careful.
Is that you? Hey. What are you doing here? I'm just out walking. I'm just frustrated. I'm tired of arguing with Liz. Well, what's going on? You want to talk about it? It's not much to talk about. It's just I'm frustrated with her. Her nagging all the time. The kids get on my nerves. I just, I just needed to get out, get a fresh breath of air. You want to join me? I'm here watching my friend play. I can't join you. I gotta go. I gotta get back to the house. But uh, yeah. I mean, uh, do you mind if I get your number? I call you sometime if you wanna like talk and chill. Okay. What right. is it? Three two zero. Okay. Eight two one. One 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 zero. Okay, well, I'll let you continue, but I'll give you a call. Okay. All right. Sure. See you. Later. Craig. Baby. Man, get away from me. Why? Felicia, what in the hell is wrong with you, Baby. man? Huh? Why you always start some Please. shit? Look, Please. Felicia, I told you, we're done. No, no. Yeah. No, yeah. Frank, I love you. Shit. You know you're the only man for me. It's a goddamn It was a mistake. A damn mistake. I didn't mean to hurt you, Craig. Everybody fine with the water? Yes. yes. Water, water? water? Okay, yeah. I'll be right back. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Hi, so are you starting? I am. Can I eat? Eat. <laughs> it's a long ride, right? Yes. Yeah. Too long. I'm just going to do this.
couldn't stand that? Everything is about me. Okay. Huh. Everything is huh. not about you. Denise, you better let her know that. Tanya, I spoke with you before about how you be acting. We're your friends. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, I don't see how your mother can deal with you at all. I don't care. Never care. Are you listening? Not really. They don't seem like you're listening. I'm tired of it, Tanya. Oh my god. You are too much. I see why Mama B act the way she acts with you. But you are too much. responsibility to spend time with the kids. I do my part. I pay the bills while you sit on your ass and do nothing. So you handle it. I'm gonna go play basketball. I did not play by myself. It takes two to have kids. I need my free time too. These are your children. Yeah, you had free time ladies night out on Friday with Denise and them. You tell the truth, that's all the time you need. So, leaving, you're wasting my time. Okay. Uh, Mom, you okay? I heard you and Dad fussing this morning. Yeah, I'm okay. And I don't want you to worry about it. I'm a big girl. I could take care of myself. What I need you to do is to make sure they help me take care of your sister. Okay? But Mom, we don't need Dad here because he's never here anyways. He's always going somewhere, playing basketball with his friends. He never spends time with us. Sorry. Your dad and I are going through some things, but don't worry about it. Right? So can you go take your sister to the park? Yeah, I'll take her. What's up? 
Why haven't you called to check up on your family? I mean, do you not care about your kids, Frank? Why do I need to call home to find out if the family's okay? If something was wrong, you'd call me. Damn. You're such a poor excuse of a father. I mean, do you know that you're so immature and that the kids here is more fussing and fighting? What's wrong with you, Frank? What's wrong with me? I like playing basketball. It's what I love to do. Well, if that's what you love to do, then why don't we take your son with you? I mean, he's 12 years old, he loves sports, and you haven't taken him to one game so he can see his father play. Damn it. I like to be by myself. All right, you know what, Frank? Do what you have to do. Just remember that you have a wife and a family here, and nothing should be more important than that. Yo, come on, man. Look like you're having trouble here. Yeah, I guess I can't get it to start. Yeah, sometimes this machine gives people trouble. Do you come here often? I do, actually. I'm Terrence, by the way. Mm -hmm. Pleasure to meet you. What are your plans after this? Just a little bit longer and maybe go home and relax. Yep. Yep. Probably gonna go grab a cup of coffee. Would you like to join me? Yeah, sure. Really? Yeah. Great. Let's go. What's up? Hey, Frank. Is Liz home yet? She's not here yet. Oh, okay. Why do you sound like that? Like you're upset or something? How have you been? Nah, I'm okay. I'm just chilling. What about you? Everything okay with you? Yeah, I was just calling to check on you. Um, that's all. I haven't heard from you in a while, so when will I see you? You haven't seen me? Now you want to see me? Drew, sure, why not? Meet me at the hotel across the street from my house in a couple of hours. Alright, see you then. Okay, bye. Well, as you know, my name's Terrence. I'm single. I live by myself. I have my own house. I'm a computer technician. Pretty boring life. It's just, <laughs> you know, trying to find the right one. Tell me about yourself. Um, <laughs> well, your son's a little bit, you know, I don't know how to say it. Okay. Um, well, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I have three beautiful children, um, and I'm married. But my husband, it's not a good situation. Um, it's kind of hard to explain. Uh, he doesn't want to be a family man. When we met, he was completely different. Um, but I guess he and I kind of grew apart. So it's, like I said, it's a really complicated situation. But... I'm grateful I have my kids in your school. Well, I love kids as well, you know, but sometimes men, when a, when a man wants to do his own thing and the woman allows him to continue to do his own thing, he, uh, he becomes set in his own ways. Yeah. I mean, it's not your fault. You're just doing what you think is the right thing to do. But regardless, if he's a real man, he would automatically know what he should do as a husband and as a father. But uh, that's where maturity comes from, you know? And it's a shame 
it's a shame that you got to go through that. You know, I would love to see that you're happy and enjoying your marriage, but I'm sorry things are not working out. Thank you. Thank you for being there for me. I don't mean to make this whole conversation about my husband. It's just, it's just so immature. But Look, I would listen to you no matter what you want to talk about. Yeah. I'm glad I met you. Thank you. I would really love to see you tomorrow at four. I would, but the kids get out of school at that time. So. Okay. How about five? That way you have enough time to spend with the kids? Yeah. I'd like that. Really? Yeah. Like that. That's awesome. That's terrific. Great. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. the best years of my life. Chris, I've given you the best years of my life too. Kim, I never cheated on you. I never wanted to cheat on you. But there you go and cheat on me. I don't... Chris, I... I don't understand, Kim. I really don't understand. You need 10 years. 10 years, Kim. That's your gangster, right? So, after I found out that you cheated on me, I didn't know what to do. My heart broke into pieces. Oh, Chris, I am so sorry. You hurt me, Kim. I'm sorry. You hurt me. Chris, I am so sorry. I couldn't even touch you. I wanted to take you out to dinner, and you never wanted to go. So one night, I went out to dinner by myself on that restaurant up the street, you remember? Yes, Where I we know. first met. And I met this young, beautiful lady. She was having dinner at home. I asked her to join me, and she did. And I must say, I had a And we continue talking on the phone and we continue seeing each other. Chris, are you cheating on me? Let me rephrase that. I love her a lot. Chris, and what I'm your wife. Ends, you what? love me. Not anymore. What are you saying to me, Chris? Not anymore, Kim. And I hope you can accept that. Chris, we can fix this. I can't communicate with you, Kel. You only see one point and one point of view only. We can fix this. I can change. 
Kimberly, I've been seeing this young lady for the past three months, right? And now, I am very much in love with her. Stop saying that! You are not in love with her! I, I'm your wife! I am in love with her. Kim, I am in love with her. You're not in love with her! Physical, emotional, and I'm not going to love What are you saying to me, Chris? Are you having sex with her? Is that what you're saying to me, Chris? You're cheating on me? I'm saying you're paying. Clearly you don't, because you act like you don't care. I cannot do this anymore. I cannot do it anymore. We can fix I this. can't. I will give you two weeks. Where am I gonna go in two weeks? Kim, I'm gonna give you two weeks to find somewhere else. Two weeks? I don't have anywhere to go, Chris. Where am I supposed to go? I'm fine. Divorce? Chris, we can fix this. And I will let the court decide on what I have to do. And I will give you $5,000 so you can get back. I'm not leaving you hanging. We share a life together. Chris, we can fix this. I'm gonna give you one of the cars. The papers are going to be in the mail once I hire a lawyer. No, Chris, no, we can fix this. I will not be staying home until you're out. Then I will come back. Understand, this is my decision. I took this decision because I want to be happy. Let's be happy together. We can fix this. You hurt me, Kim. I'm sorry, Chris. You hurt me. I'm so sorry. Hey, babe. Hey, babe. Chris! Let me finish talking to Kim. I'll call you back, okay? okay. You're gonna disrespect me and take a phone call while I'm talking to you? Who is that? You know who's that. That's the woman I love. No! Ah, Felicia, what the hell are you doing here? Chris, I didn't mean to hurt you. I didn't mean to sleep with your friends. I went to the bar with my friends and I saw Alex and April. I went over to speak to them and they asked me where you were. And I told them that you were home waiting for me, baby. And they said they couldn't believe that I was out by myself. And Alex asked if I wanted a drink. And I told him yes. Oh, yeah. Please, please let me explain. I had four back to back and I was feeling good. Felicia, you know how much liquor is in that? I know, I know. Please, please, Craig. They asked me if I wanted to hang out with them. I guess I said yes. You guess you said yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. They oh. took me upstairs and they started taking off my clothes. I was drunk. I was drunk, Craig. I couldn't stop. Oh, really? So you're telling me you were drunk? So, oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. so this is what I don't get then. If you was drunk, how do you remember so many details? That's just, that's just funny to me. No, Alex started taking off his clothes, and then that's when we started having sex. It just happened. Please forgive me, Craig. Give me another chance, please. See, I, I can kind of understand the first time, <laughs> but you did it a second time. Felicia, you did it twice with both of them. So I don't want to hear nothing that you got to say, because I know it's bullshit. I know it's bullshit. Craig, Craig, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I love you and I don't want to lose you. Please. You hurt me, Felicia. So I can't forgive you. Listen, I, I, I'm trying to watch a football game and, and you making me miss it. I know I should have went to church today. Okay, okay. I'll let you watch the game. I love you, Craig. Felicia, 
just just leave. There's, there's, there's no more me and you. We're done. What don't you understand about that? Just leave. No. No. I know you miss me. Please. What are you what are you doing? Stop touching me. Just, just move now. Stop touching me. Craig, you're special to me. I gave you my body because I thought that's what you wanted. Now you're telling me you don't even want me? That hurts. You telling me that shit? You don't want me? I thought you loved me. I thought you wanted me. <laughs> now that's funny. Listen, 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 listen. I did want you. <laughs> and, 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 and I, I did want you up. And, and I always will. If you'll excuse me, no. I'm missing the game. No. Come on. No. Come on. Go. No, Greg. No. 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 Hey, Liz. How you doing? Me? No, I'm just here working, working on this printer. Busy day. Um, the reason why I'm calling was, was just, I want to tell you that I just can't stop thinking about you. And uh, I was wondering if you would like to have dinner with me tonight at my place. I'll make something extra special for you. Really? How's six o'clock? Great. All right. Well, let me get things ready and I'll head out from work and I'll see you there. Great. Bye bye. Oh, never mind. I ooh, 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 ooh. Stink. Ah, look, look, look at all the big ones. Big one, big one. That big one just all the way over there. Sex. I got a girlfriend on the north side of town. I got a girlfriend on the west side. They both know I'm married. Besides, I'm tired of the married life, the kids, her complaining all the time. So why you ask? I was just asking if you ever thought Liz would cheat on you. Liz ain't gonna cheat on me. I got her in check. She loves me too much and the kids. Yeah, she's a good mother. But I pay the bills. As long as it's coming in, the money's coming in, she's good. She ain't going nowhere. Honey, stay here. I'm gonna be going, okay? Okay, hey, Mom, be safe and have fun wherever you're going tonight. I love you. Bye. See you later. Okay, you say that now, but 
you don't know, she's all about money and us women are sneaky, so. You think Liz cheating on me? Really? I mean, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying, you know, you need to watch your surroundings because Liz is not a dummy. But I do think you're fine and I don't want you to get hurt. But enough talking about Liz. Let's go get in the hot tub. Hell yeah. <laughs> You know my spray be dirty, run my bread in a hurry And that's a lame, he ain't worth it. I tell these, tell these, catch me out Ain't got no love for no goofy You treat him like a king, but your nigga is my ruby Something like a pimp, so grab his hand Yo, the truly told my son when I die, bury me like a flu Catch me out We, 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 we 
We we crushing late night. Take the high road here. I hope you and my wife have a happy life together. No. You deserve each other. No. Okay? I'm so sorry. Shut up! Baby, no. If you want to deal with her, do it on your turf, not on mine. I'm so sorry. You got a lot of explaining. Okay, baby. You oh, both have a wonderful oh, night. We can fix this. There's nothing to be fixed here. Please, baby, just I am listen. gone. It was a mistake. I'm sorry. Okay, it was a pleasure meeting you. It was a pleasure meeting you, too. Take care of her, because she needs it. <laughs> Although she did a lot of crying and a lot of lying, but it's okay. Why was she crying and lying knowing that she committed an affair on you? That you work for the government and you can find anything and everything. It was a trip. I know, sweetie. But... It's okay. That's <laughs> why okay. So why would she deny having an affair? I told her how I felt. How I felt the relationship was no longer. I told her I knew she had a boyfriend. I told her where he lives, where I seen them. Everything. But of course, she denies it. Kim will never be honest. She acts like she wasn't having a, an affair with another man. I think she went out with that guy, Terrence, the guy at the club. Not Liz. Yes. Um, when they was dancing in the club, you know, so I think they went out together. Even Eric. Eric will be home tomorrow. Oh, I know you're happy. I can sit around in my pants. Yes. Look at you with your heart felt. So, you know, Tanya, she <laughs> is doing crazy stuff. Again? Yeah. And I know Mama B is tired. I feel sorry for that old lady. Yeah. But you know what? Wish I could find a mom. One day, Keish. Right? You know, maybe Robert might be the one. Because
That was a good one. Let's go. Slip and slide on it. It's a world that you can glide on it. It's so drippy, lose your mind in it. Deep dive, come on, run it. Do not rush, just take your time in it. Front to back, side to side with it. Lord, I thank you for my beautiful granddaughter. Uh, Lord, I thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Thank you. Lord, I thank you for my wretched daughter. Lord, please help my daughter. Lord, I need you to help her. She needs all the help she can get. In Jesus' name, amen. Is this a joke? Are you for real? Can you help me clear the table? Tina, you need to grow up and get a man. Look how happy Liz is nowadays. Well, I know it's not right in God's eyes that a married woman talking to a man. But her husband is not being the man he needs to be. And Liz is a good woman. And she take care of children. If Frank doesn't straighten up, he's going to lose his children and his wife.
I mean, he already lost her. But anyway, I'm happy for Liz and her children. Ma, I'm a grown woman. I don't need no damn man to take care of me or Alexis. I'm enjoying myself, and Liz better watch out before her husband finds she is cheating. Adultery. Okay, and she don't even like tears like that. She, she is just she is just playing him. And plus Frank looks way much better than him. Sound like you're jealous of Liz. Jealous? Never jealous. I'm not jealous of Liz. I feel sorry for you. You better feel sorry for Liz. What are you talking about? You are evil. I can see the evil in your eyes. Don't do anything to that girl. She's your friend. Where are you off to? Another basketball tournament? No, Liz. Just going out for a minute or so. What's a minute or so? Your minute or so is like an hour. Whatever. Go have fun. What's your problem? You're always thinking someone's out there doing something. I'm tired of your attitude. I'm tired of you not trusting in me. I'm not out there doing anything. I'm just having fun with my friends. Since you have friends, how come I never see you with them? And how come you can't spend time with your kids? I don't care if you don't spend time with me but your kids is another story. I'm just worried that what you're doing is gonna make them cut you out of their lives. You guys, stop arguing! My kids will not cut me out of their lives. I'm their father. I ain't going nowhere. I'll talk to you later. You're such a loser. Come on. So I did, and it just dropped too. Frank, you okay? I feel weird. Hey. It's not wrong. You won't. I care about you. I'm here for you. Tell me, what happened? Chris. Yes. I'm so you're hundred percent, this is my baby, right Sasha? Yes, Chris. Are you sure? Yes, Chris. I'm having your baby. Are you ready for this? Hell yeah, I'm ready for this. You know what? There's only one thing left. Yes. Sacha. Mi amor. I know we only been together three months. And since the moment I saw you at that bar, I realized you were meant for me. And since you have my baby, I think it's the right moment for me to ask. 
will you marry? <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Alexis, baby, are you okay? Yes, Nana. Nana and Mom coming home. I guess you'll be here sooner or later, baby. That's all Nana can tell. You. Okay? Mommy! Hey, baby. Hey, Mom. Hey, sweetheart. What's the matter? You look like you're down. I am. I just, I miss my dad. I understand, sweetheart. Listen, I miss your father, too. I mean, he was the rock for this whole family. He was your rock. He was my rock. He was Alexis' rock. And we miss him dearly. But we do have to go on with our lives. You know, I know I've been hard on you. But just look at it like this. An old woman's wisdom that loved you very much. And I want to see you do good and do good by Alexis. I know, but it's just hard when he's not around. I know, he's around. He's in your heart. He's everywhere you're, you are. And you have to remember that. Remember the good time. I, I, know, that. I know you're hurting, sweetheart. I can see it in your face. Come on, you just don't understand how it feels to lose your father. I mean, I want the best for Alexis, but it's hard when you don't have anyone to help. I know you help, but I, I never had a man figure in my life, so how can I give that to Alexis when my father is not, he wasn't around? But it's not that easy. I see Liz and she's happy. But I can never find love, so how can I give that to Alexis? Hey, baby, I'm so glad y'all made it here. Hey, Mama, did you want to help you with something? Yes, baby, take that out the bag over yes, there. And baby, you take that top off that cookie there. And we need some chip open. Okay, Mama. Mama, Felicia's here. Oh my God, come here. Oh, praise the Lord, baby. <laughs> What's going oh, on, everybody? Hey, hey. 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 Mama. Hey, baby. Oh, oh. Hey, who is who? To us. Look, you ain't got to apologize. I had a long time to think about this, and at the end of the day, I want you in my life. You feel me? Yes. Yes, baby. Yes. Yeah, but, you know, I, I had a lot of time to think about, you know, everything that happened, and I just feel like with you in my life, it's just more complete. You know I feel the same way. You know what I'm saying? Yes. 
I'm sorry. I'm willing to work this out. I'm willing to put everything behind this. But you got to be real. You got to keep it 100. I know. Anything. Anything, baby. Nah, I'm serious, man. Don't just say that. You got to keep it 100 with me. I will. Hey, everybody. Hey. How are you doing? Hi. Girl, what you eating? That looks good. good. How you doing, baby? Hey, baby. How are you? I'm good. Oh, it's so good to see you. Hey, baby. You two, y'all both looking fabulous. Thank you. Y'all have y'all step to the food now. Come on. Plenty of food. Well, hello. <laughs> Praise the Lord. No, don't worry about it. I don't want. I don't want anything else to eat. I'm good. You sure? I don't know. We got some sandwiches. Which the one? Oh, can I have a donut, please? Sure, baby. Y'all can't hear my dessert. All right. Are you? You want some strawberries? Can I have some food? Yeah, here. So what do we have? Okay. Uh, you're welcome. Can I get some help? I got an old thing. Yeah. I got an old thing. No, some people have to eat one. Oh, hey. Good about them. Mom, this is easy. Okay, you got a piece of chicken. Oh, you know. Yeah, you got your hand over, huh? Uh, <laughs> okay, he's gonna let him know. Y'all want this chicken? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See, nobody can eat it. Nobody can eat it. Oh, yeah. Mama, Mama B! <laughs>